kind of stoned right now. And what do I want to rant about right now? I don't know. Just like... <sighs> um, God damn. Sorry, I was just watching The Office. It never ceases to amuse me. Also, just super comforting. Very even-tempered. Like, you know, they never get too dark. Uh, and sometimes you want that, you know? Like, ooh, my, got a fucking, like, like this, almost. <laughs> That's what happens when I get stoned, though. When I close is more than the other. But, uh, I was just thinking about having money and what I would do with it. And one thing I would do with it, because I'm kind of insane, I wasn't allowed Barbies as a child. And you should never disallow a child from having something because later in life they may um, acquire a fetish of sorts for it. You know? Um, if you see what I mean, this is actually not up here too. These are the, these aren't display dolls, so. That's why they're not up here. Also, they're not pivotal. Their arms aren't even pivotal. So, um, if I'm using the right word, I hope. So, yeah. Um, so when you deprive your child of something, uh, that's what can happen sometimes. So, and I'm like, if I had a lot of money, like a lot, a lot of money, I could see myself easily spending, easily spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on Barbies, which is insane. But the thing is, they're not actually a bad investment because once they get to be about 30 years old, they're worth a shit ton of money, like, regardless. And, you know, if you hold on to them and take good care of them, they're, they're very, they can be very valuable because there are a lot of people like me who are totally insane and like to collect dolls because we secretly don't want to grow up. <laughs> I think it's about as simple as that. But, um, uh, no, so it just, like, I would definitely have a lot of cars too. A lot of designer fragrances and like, that's my little perfume collection. I like to collect things. It's, it's just something I do. I, I don't have to explain why. I don't know why, really. So I couldn't really explain why. I just do. I'm excessive. So, there you go. But, yeah. So, let's see. What was I... This is why it's a rant. Because a lot of times I get lost in my train of thought. And uh, then I'm like, what am I saying? What am I talking about? What am I doing? And it just, it can get complicated, you know? Um, I mean, when I actually sit down and articulate my thoughts, like, goddamn, I can do a good job. Like, I'd read some of my stuff, but I'm really afraid of plagiarism. I know there's, like, a some kind of something on when you put something on YouTube, that like, a, an electronic whatever, but some, like, patent or something, but copyright. I don't know, but, so I'm a little hesitant about that, mostly because it, it's, I haven't gotten it to where I'm feeling comfortable with it, you know, otherwise I'd submit it for publishing before I read it online. If it got rejected, sure, I'd submit it for, I'd read it online, but if it got rejected from being submitted for publishing, my eyelashes on this eye are all, like, flat, but I'm so scared of eyelash curlers, those things are scary. I'm like, girls who use eyelash curlers, my hat is off to you, but I think they're bad for your lashes, unless, like, you you put your lashes in a state where they can be curled like that, you know, like, product, like, basically with your hair, but, like, my hat is off to you, but I can't do those things that are so fucking scary, I just... I'm scared of eyelash curlers. That's, that's all there is to it. <laughs> oh my god. I don't even know what's going on. I'm fucking tally right now. <laughs> but I'm like... 
damn. I don't know. I think I'll try to put these up more often. So we'll just do shorter, a shorter one. Only five minutes. Later, guys.